appeared on the internet at 3 o'clock this morning. My declaration of war against the United States of America and its allies. Until every last foreign soldier has left Georgia, this war will continue on American soil and around the world, claiming the lives of the aggressors. The scales of power have been newly balanced, and we will no longer accept the tyranny of the United States. Blame the U.S. media for their part in spreading Kambayne Nikoladze's message. Ironic counterpoint to the situation at home, U.S. soldiers in Georgia and Azerbaijan have spent their fifth night without combat. Though tensions remain high, military intelligence has been unable to locate any remaining Georgian commando. Have dramatically increased their efforts to find Kambayne Nikoladze. U.S. intelligence is combing a constantly expanding search radius extending from Georgia. Each new country another possible secret alliance with the... Because what we have here is a situation where further airstrikes just won't do any good. Nikolat's army, if that's what you want to call it, is a bunch of... As morning relatives prepare funeral services, America's law enforcement and military forces prepare for the unknown waiting for Combain Nikoladze's next move. Well, well, well. Hello everyone, Frank Tastic here. Welcome back to Splinter Cell. Uh, I can't remember what episode this is. Four, maybe? This might be episode four. Anyways, let's continue on with this game and its story and so on and so forth. Uh, recover the encryption key. Russian mercenaries have begun to destroy evidence of Georgian activities at Galinatik. Uh, before her detection in the network, Grimstarter discovered that a technician named Ivan is hiding in the building. Uh, Ivan possesses a, an encryption key that could help Third Echelon find Nikolai. Nikolaites. Alright. Okay. Be sure your mission is a man named Ivan. When Grimstarter got made in Kalinitech's server, Nikolaj's mercenaries got spooked. They're pulling up stakes, wiping out all evidence of their presence, including Ivan and his comrades. Who? Ah! One of the keys, a programmer. They're killing their own men. It's all evidence. Let's pray you find them first. Details on your offside. Hey, yeah. You have blood on your shoe. So I do. This is terrible so work. You're looking down directly from Grinko. Yes. If I didn't hear him like the Reaper, I'd be long gone. He told me to think of them as sheep. He says we are sinning the flock. Hmm. Uh. I might not actually do too much commentary in this video, mostly because I'm actually pretty pretty exhausted. West wing of deep war is clear, moving on to sea. How many encryption keys did you retrieve? This is our seventh. Are you sure he's dead? Come on, we can see his brain. Of course he's dead. He should be in the dark, but I might actually need to move his body, to be honest. Might need to move it. Bring 
right here. That should be better. Uh, let's see. 97531. 97531. Uh, ammo? Might as well go in and reload my weapons. I don't think, yeah, as you can say, I don't think I can actually pick that up, because I think 60 is all I can, uh, all I can hold. Nothing? Nobody? Ugh. My allergies is messing up right now. East wing of port clear. Three encryption keys retreat. The arc files destroyed. Every one of them. Thank God. Make sure you leave the bodies where the fire will get them. Of course. Uh, save, 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 save. Belling. Last week it was those turrets. This week it's wall mines. So, I use the tools they give me. You obsess over them. You have to admit, these are cool. Yes, but if we plant too many, it's dangerous. They're supposed to be dangerous. They're mines, for God's sake. Oh, it's all fast up, hey, dangerous. I hate the wall mines in this game. When I was doing my first playthrough, I don't know what the heck the issue was. But every time I would sneak up to the wall mine and try to deactivate it, it would uh, just blow up in my face. Which was extremely, extremely weird. Didn't make any sense. Because I did exactly everything I was supposed to correctly. And it would still blow up. And I was like, I don't know. my NVGs to be honest. Huh. Got him. Uh is there anything in here? No. Alright, I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. That was Barely move to it, right? Barely. Weird. Barely move to it. This is me barely ta tapping the uh, thumbstick, right? I mean, you can slowly walk to it like this. Anyways, I am on it. I can't even stand up either. Anyways, <laughs> I don't want to disable it because I'm afraid it's just gonna blow blow up in my face. Anyways, I would do it, you know, crouch up all the way at it, and I would hit disable, and I would, I, I don't know, I don't know. There, it's just a random thing. Cause there's times where I would sneak walk up to the mine and deactivate it and it would be fine and then there's times where I would sneak up to the mine and deactivate it and it just blows up in my face it's, it's random
Well, it actually didn't blow up in my face that time. <laughs> I, I don't understand it. I, I truly do not understand it. Uh, I think these bodies are okay. Especially if I can turn this light out, which I don't think I can. Uh, shoot. These lights, can I not shoot these lights out? I'm telling you, the pistol is so bad in this game. <laughs> so bad in this game. It's only worth using to shoot out lights. Like, 100%. Don't even try to use it to take out enemies. It's not really worth it. I'm gonna move uh, these two bodies though, just to be safe. God dang it. Uh, I don't really have much to say. We just sussed a little more out of Ivan. There's a group of mercenary programmers alive on the third floor. They're trapped behind a cluster of wall mines. You think they might have mercenaries? It's worth checking. Satchel. <gasps> Face shot. Do you have a satchel? No. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, I freaking hate this port. It's freaking Walmart's. Carrying too many wall mines. What am I supposed to do about that? What am I supposed to do about that? I need an encryption key. We don't have any. Why should I believe you? There is a bomb. Bombs like a blob in my face, isn't it? planted it to destroy the data archives, but they put it right next to the gas pipes. It will take out this whole floor. How do I get there? You will need the keypad code for the door. I think it's three three five seven five. Grim check the building specs. That geek's story about gas pipes holds up. I'm on my way. Make it fast. You don't have a lot of time. I'm on fire. Uh, what was what was it? Uh, three three five seven five. Three, three, five, seven, five. Oh, I can't see shit. Pick locking in this game is actually fairly easy, but the thing that kind of annoys me is you have to rotate the left analog stick 
until it starts vibrating and then that vibrating is where you need to hold it so you it, you know fix the lock but the thing is like I'm holding it at the strongest vibration point and it just takes forever for it to actually like pick it I'm just like oh man I crafted that uh did it great work Bishop that could have been bad but we've got a new twist we'll it. I hacked into the power somebody's thrown the breaker on the fire door circuit meaning you won't be able to open the doors until you found that breaker details on your upset I feel like the night vision in this game is better than the night vision in Breakpoint, but the distance that the night vision goes isn't not even close to being as good as the uh, Breakpoint's vision. Or, I mean, the distance of the uh, night vision. I could have spotted somebody in the auditorium. Maybe our intruder. I need backup now. Excuse me. <sighs> These guys, their uh, footsteps are synchronized perfectly. Oh, there you go. Third guy. Yeah, so you can say that third guy is still down here. Uh... How the hell? Frag grenade. I think they're coming back down. Yeah, I can say I think they're coming back down here. I've got a man unconscious. <coughs> I've got a man unconscious. <coughs> Pretty easy. My uh, my first time playing this part, I didn't even do this. Uh, when the first two ran upstairs, I just took them out upstairs, and then uh, the this third guy actually went up the stairs after I took the first two out. So uh, doing it this way was actually my first time doing it that way. Which of course the other time I did it was my first time doing it that way. So. <laughs> Uh, I don't know what I'm saying. Probably because I'm exhausted. I love the freaking roll in this game. I don't know why.
I'm not sure where this guy came from. He probably came from uh, that door up there. Because obviously I came from this direction. And uh, didn't really notice these two guys. Uh, let's keep it uh, 1250. Uh, 1250. Uh, oh, it's this freaking part. Grenade. Do I get in a firefight in this mission? I don't think I do. Maybe I do. I don't know. Honestly, don't remember too much about this uh, this mission. Dang allergies. That was weird. I thought he was going to come over here because I shot right here, but. And he said, Who is that? So. I thought. He didn't care about the light. Apparently he did care about the light. Can you talk? I don't want to die here. Are you alive? Who? No. It hurts. Please, take me to the infirmary. Okay. There anything in here other than objects? No. And there's two med kits in here. Again, I, I I do apologize for the lack of commentary, and when I do co actually say something, it's not really much of anything. Like I said, I'm just exhausted. <laughs> I I played a lot of Ghost Recon Breakpoint earlier, getting a lot of videos because I got some things coming up in the next few days, so I'm not gonna be able to actually play. So I had to record like a bunch of videos and like one. <laughs> one recording session, so anyways, no one cares. Thank you. Who are you? Do you have an encryption key? They took it. Destroyed it. They've gone mad. I don't know what... I need to find a man named Ivan. He's locked himself behind the building's fire doors. Then, 
He must be on the fifth floor. That helps. Thanks. So tired. Yeah, you're probably gonna die. Bullet, do you read me? Bullet, I think I found something useful. A computer with a window that says, Fire Emergency System. Bullet, are you there? It is weird though because my first playthrough, uh, I was gonna just walk up behind this guy and knock him out, but I shot this like I just did, and you know the guy got stunned by it. But I also shot it from over here my first time, so I wonder. I, I don't think so, but I wonder if me shooting it from right here, the game may be bugged out to where him being alerted to my gunshot overrode this stunning him? I don't know. I guess it doesn't matter too much. Moving on. Good work, Fisher. Opening those fire doors cleared your path to Ivan, but it did the same thing for the Russians. You better make damn sure you get to him first. Uh. Update on your situation. To cover our asses politically, we clued in the FBI. We're gonna have to leave Ivan for them. So what am I doing here? Ivan's a technicality. All we need to trace Nikolaj's is his encryption key. Get that, and we're golden. Okay. We will already check this hallway. We might have missed something. We'll check it again. How could we have missed somebody? Listen. This order came down directly from Vicious Green Call. If just one of these geeks gets out of here alive, he'll skin us all. Yeah, well... Well what? Nothing! Hold on a second. I need to visit the little boy's room. Make it fast. I don't. <laughs> uh, I, I. I don't know, man. I'm kind of disappointed in the whole grabbing people, only because like it tries to teach you like, oh, you know, you can grab people and interrogate. Nah. Who are you you only actually interrogate. Because <laughs> the game wants you to. I don't want the damn phone. I want you to tell me who you're talking to. I don't know. I thought it was the cops. <laughs> uh. Satchel. Are you Ivan? I... Yes. You are American? You are police? Yes and no. The police are on their way. Until they get here, I'm the only friend you've got. And I'm not a very good one. We have to leave. We have to hurry. They'll find us soon. That's not my job. I'm here for your encryption key. That wasn't the deal. The deal still stands. The feds will get you out of here alive, but first you have to give me the key. That wasn't the deal I made with the woman on the phone. Listen, do I come to your job and tell you how to murder civilians? What? No. So don't come to my job and tell me how to do mine. The feds are on their way or here already. You're gonna be fine. 
you can give me the key, or I can take it. That wasn't the deal. You're working from a very limited phrase book. Listen, just give me the key. I'm tired and I hate making people scream. It gets me down. Here. Thanks. And until the feds get here, find a better hiding place. God damn it! <laughs> Go away! I'm hiding! Yeah, me, I'm hiding. Perfect. Fisher, you're gonna like this. It makes me nervous when you say that. The Russians are all over the top floor. They're gonna have to do some cleaning before the Osprey can safely touch down for extraction. Uh, okay. I think I actually remember this part. I mean, I do remember it, I just... I can't remember exactly, like, everything about it. I remember what happens at the end, but I don't remember this entire, entire part of the, uh... Alright, uh... All right. Uh. I, 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 I Tonight's work is some of the worst I've ever done. It will be over soon. Hey! Hold it! Is that frag grenades? Is that frag grenades? I don't... I don't know, I can't pick any... I can't pick it up. Oh yeah, I hated this part because like for some reason this random part of this whole mission these three guys know exactly where you are and it's like it doesn't make sense. Where'd that third guy go. I think he's over here. Oops, wrong button. I think he's over here, behind this. Oh no, he's behind the forklift. Come out wherever you are. But yeah, it, it's <laughs> that's like the only part of this whole thing where the bad guys know where you are, and it's it's kind of weird. I don't know if there's something you can do so where they don't know that you're there. I don't know. Maybe those first two guys you just don't uh don't mess with them, don't get into a firefight with them. Oh yeah, th this part too. Oli, oli, oxen, Stay back. Did you just throw a grenade at me? <laughs> the freaking recoil on this weapon is so bad. So 
I think the next part it goes back to them not knowing that you're here. If I can figure out what the hell the next part is. Oh, is it this way? Yeah. Actually, there's that one. It didn't freaking go off. the trigger up there with that. Whoa! How did that happen? I've got a corpse here. I've got a corpse here. Oh, kind of funny. My first time, I just kind of snuck around and then knocked him out. It took a bit longer than that, most definitely. But, I don't know. That was just kind of funny. Hey. Someone in here? Yeah. Someone is in here. Oh man. I'm <laughs> I was trying to shoot these three freaking lights. Insane. I guess this is what I get for playing while exhausted. But oh well. I'm close to the end anyways. This is the last part of the uh, this mission. Jesus, too many freaking checkpoints. All right, yeah, I think this might be the last part. I'm not sure. Lights freaking bright. What was you gonna say? Uh, I couldn't understand you. Probably, probably because my fist was in your face. Yeah, this is the last part. Oh no! Huh. Can't really 
can't see anybody. Actually, I think it was just because uh, both of their both of their weapons going off at the same time. <laughs> but still, that <laughs> just sounded crazy. Oh no, my buddy! Uh, allergies. So yeah, that was that mission. The mission's not hard. Uh, a lot of that stuff, even when I did my first playthrough the other day, I actually remembered a lot of stuff in that mission from when I used to play this game years ago. Remember, I haven't played this game in like 18 years. But uh, that was one of the missions I used to replay constantly when I was a kid because I just really liked that mission. Um, so yeah, when I first played through it the other day, uh, there was a lot of stuff in that mission I already knew, so. <laughs> oh, the encryption key retrieved from Ivan allows Grimm's daughter to trace a data stream back to a nuclear power plant on the uh, Kola Pensuela. Pensuela. I can't read, man. Leave me alone. Of northern Russia, American intelligence first saw the lead on the whereabouts of combined Nikolaids. Awesome. I'm exhausted. I'm going to end this video right here, not really say anything else other than I'm ending this video. Hope you have an amazing day. Click the like button if you enjoyed. I'm going to bed because I'm exhausted.